Okay, question 2.4 from paper 1 from Eastern Cape 2022 on reproduction in vertebrates, life sciences, grade 12 exam question. Okay, so this is the question, question 2.4. You have three questions to answer. Okay, let's get started. 2.4, the diagram below shows a bird nest in a high tree with some newly hatched birds. Okay. 2.4.1 State two observable reason why this type of development can be regarded as altricial. 2 marks. Okay. So when you observe, what can you say about this being regarded as altricial? Okay. 2.4.1 You can see you don't have feathers. Okay. The chicks do not have feathers. Okay. No feathers and they cannot move. Okay. Unable to move and the eyes are closed. Okay. So this is what we have to know about altricial development as compared to precocial development. Okay. So in altricial development, you have the young ones, they are less developed. Okay. In altricial development, the young ones are less developed. Okay. This is the reason why you have no feathers, unable to move, and the eyes are still closed. This is what we have to know about altricial development. Okay, now question 2.4.2. Explain one advantage of the nest being high in the tree for the altricial development in an ecosystem. Okay, three marks. You know these chicks, they are what? They are altricial. Okay, they are less developed. So they cannot escape from predators. They cannot move. Okay, for them to be safe, the nest must be high in the tree. Okay, so because this is high in the tree, it will not be accessible to many predators. Okay, so if you want to explain one advantage of the nest being high in the tree for the altricial development in an ecosystem, you can say not accessible to many predators because the chicks cannot escape from them, from the predators. Okay, therefore, increasing the chances of survival okay so this is how you can explain one advantage of the nest being high in the tree for the altricial development in an ecosystem now question 2.4.3 okay explain the volume of the yolk in an amniotic egg of the bird that is precocial as compared to the same size of bird that is altricial okay three marks explain the volume of the yolk in an amniotic egg of the bird that is precocial as compared to the same size of the volume of the yolk of bird that is altricial. So you have to compare the volume of the yolk in precocial and in altricial. Okay. So you have to remember that precocial birds are born fully developed and altricial birds are born less developed. Okay. So this the volume of this will be more than the volume of this. Okay. The volume of the yolk of precocia will be more than the volume of the yolk of altricial. Okay. So you can answer this question as the yolk volume in precocial bed will be more than in altricial bed. Okay. Because the precocial bed needs more nutrient so that it can be born fully developed okay remember precocial birds or young that are precocial are born fully developed and for this reason the yolk volume in precocial bed is more than in altricial bed okay because it needs more nutrient to be born fully developed okay so this is how you can answer these questions we are done with question 2.4 until next time i will talk to you soon